Now to the growing outrage over an incident at a Little League baseball tournament in Houston. Parents are furious, saying a coach on the losing team got too aggressive with kids during the traditional handshake after the game. The video is blowing up on TikTok. Xavier Walton shows us how a moment that's supposed to show good sportsmanship turns out to be just the opposite. The game was over, but the drama was just getting started when these two teams lined up to shake hands. Just listen. Ah, oh, that kid hit me hard. The kid hit me hard. Well, I got hit right in the head. The kid hit me hard. That coach pulled me back. Prospects Baseball just beat Scorpions, Team Eastern Red. Watch again. This time, watch the coach in khaki shorts, who appears to do a little more than a simple high five. Nothing in the world gives you a right to go in and do that to kids. Especially. Victor Torres coaches the prospects. Torres says you'd expect it from the kids, but the coach? They'll come in here and slap you hard on the hand and be like, hey, don't do that, you know? But an adult, you wouldn't expect it. Here's how Scorpions Baseball responded, saying his actions were unacceptable and do not align with our organization's values. We removed him from coaching and from our club around 8.30 a.m. Sunday. The coach seen displaying poor sportsmanship is Kenneth Went. He's a member of the Harris County Constable Precinct 5 office. In January of 2021, he was promoted to sergeant, according to Precinct 5's Facebook page. How is that even possible? You know, you, you, you hold them to a higher standard and then you come out here and do that to, to kids. A parent from the Scorpions who was at the game defending the former coach, saying, quote, we have known the Went family for two years and Kenny has always been a great husband, father and coach. Okay, okay. As for Coach Torres, like I tell my kids, we don't lose, we learn. Ow, ow. He says this was a teachable moment for everyone. You don't do that to a nine-year-old. You don't put your hands on nine-year-olds, especially someone else's child. Now, public information officer for the Harris County Constable said they're aware of the incident and they are investigating.